Good morning. Welcome back. I actually graduated college last week and I also moved home. So I don't live in California anymore for now. This is just temporary. I'll keep you guys updated. But I thought a fun vlog for today would be to do a summer day in my life. I'm just gonna basically vlog my day today. This is my Minnesota house. If you guys have been with me for a while, you would recognize my Minnesota home that I grew up in. I have been really liking to get some sun and I do not tan very well, okay? I'm just gonna say it. I don't, but a little bit of sun, like I'm talking half an hour, is good. A little tan, I try. Most of this is my fake tanner that you're seeing, so. I love it here so much. It's so green. I usually just like to lay right here on my deck and I'll put like a little towel down, it's so comfy. I'm saying usually like I do this, like I literally have been home for a week, but I'm using the Sun Bum tanning oil. Hey guys, it's hour four. I'm just kidding. It's literally like 30 minutes later. It's so hot. I don't know if this is sweat or the tanning oil. Probably a mix of both. Uh... I showered. And I'm wearing one of my favorite tanks. It's from Hollister. And then for pants, I'm wearing these fold-over pants. I got them from Addicted. And my dirty Air Forces that I need to clean. Also, that's me when I was like 12. Oh my god. Oh my god, it smells horrible in here. Holy. Something's definitely rotting in this car. I'm headed to the Mall of America. And of course, where am I stopping as well? On the way, Starbucks. Thank you. See, I wanted to ask for a napkin, but then I got lazy because I was sitting by the window and no one was coming up to me. I'm waiting for the day that I feel sick of this and it just hasn't come yet. I also got a sandwich because I'm hungry. This is the bacon Gouda one. Guys, this is my favorite store. They have them in Orange County in California. It's called Goriana. I'm so excited that they're opening one here. Since I grew up like 10 minutes from Mall of America, when I moved to California like four years ago and I started going to the malls there, I had such a like reality check because this mall has every single store that you could ever imagine. And I was just so used to the convenience of it. I thought that was a person. It's a mannequin. When I was in VS, I freaked out for two seconds because I thought I lost my bag. Like I couldn't find it. I was like, oh my God, where did I put it? And then I find it on the other side of the store. Like I just set it down when I was looking and I forgot about it. So thank God no one took it. I need help. Okay, I'm done at the mall. I just got this from the vending machine. <laughs> so random. Me and my roommates were obsessed with these like right before I left. Garden Salsa Sun Chips. And I saw them in there. I, I do not see them everywhere. So I knew I needed to get them. I got so much stuff. Like you guys are not ready for this haul. Obviously you guys know, I'm not gonna go to the mall and then not show you guys a haul because that would just be rude. So first things first, I had a gift card to use at Hollister. I walked in and I saw this on one of the mannequins. It's this dainty blue floral top. It's very pretty and I think like for a brunch or something, this would be really cute to wear. You guys saw, I went to Aritzia. I love Aritzia. I do think it is my new obsession. I also know I am late on the Aritzia hype but I'm late to a lot of things. So I got mostly basics. I got these long flare gray yoga pants. I also got two of the same top. I feel like you guys know I'm pretty notorious for buying the same thing in like four different colors. If I like it, I feel like I just need the whole color spread. 
I had been wanting to get this specifically from them, this off the shoulder top, and I loved the beige color. I really don't have a lot of beige tops like this. And then I got the same thing in black, but they're shipping it to my house because they didn't have my size in store, so. And then I went to Urban Outfitters. This is the bag that I almost left in Victoria's Secret. Kind of a funny story because I saw this top and I love it so much. I just think it's so delicate. I love the ruching at the top, but I think it was from the lingerie section. But I do think, especially nowadays, people wear kind of like lingerie looking things as tops out. I think it can look really cute. So I got a little hair bow. I have been seeing these all over my Pinterest. Guys, I'm not banned on Pinterest anymore. Thank God. Now that my Pinterest is back, I've been seeing so many of these like bows on there or like lace hair accessories. So I saw this and this seems like really easy. I could just put my hair half up, half down. And last but not least, I went to Victoria's Secret. I just needed two new bras, but got a black one. <laughs> I don't know, and a nude one. Yeah, that's about it. I'm gonna make some dinner now though. I've been wanting to make this like, tomato pasta thing. I've kind of been eating out a lot since I'm home. I have the whole kitchen to myself. What's this called? Panzella? Panzella? Panzanella. Oh, Panzanella. Okay. So my mom has made this recipe pretty often the past couple years. It's really, really good. It's kind of like a lighter meal. It's basically like a bread salad. It has tomatoes, cheese. I'll put the link to it down below if they want to make it. See, so yeah, I got all the ingredients like the basil, the red wine vinegar, and I'm going to start chopping the tomatoes. I didn't do the cucumber because I hate cucumber. I agree. I was gonna Oh, really? Thank God. It's been 30 minutes. I put this in the fridge and I think it just like marinates all the ingredients together. I'm going to do a little taste test. Just as good as I remember. I am on my way to see my bestie ever. You guys know her, you love her, Rachel. Wow, that was a pretty good intro for her, honestly. I showered and I changed into some more comfy clothes. It's still so hot and it's 7 p.m. It's almost 90 degrees. Me and Rachel are going penny boarding. If you guys know us, you know that we always do this and like it's our thing. We go to the top of these parking garages, usually like this mall, certain mall by us we go to. So I'm gonna go pick her up. I'm with Rachel. I hyped you up so much for this too. Okay. So we're back in Minnesota and now we're gonna go penny boarding because we always go penny boarding. Bro, I hate this skateboard. Okay. I mean, yours is ratchet. It's so ratchet. Wait, you should try mine. Try mine. Oh, I've tried yours before. <laughs> <laughs> 